Hey everyone, thank you for joining this free training. My name is Morris Peace, and I'm going to show you how to attract the clients you deserve with your bio. And you're going to put this on all your social media. So TikTok, Instagram, uh, Facebook, YouTube, anything where there's a bio option there, put this there. All right, let's dive into it, okay? Why should you even care? All right, so this bio helps you attract followers who are genuinely interested in the content and your services, increasing engagement and building a loyal community. It highlights your credentials, expertise, achievements uh, that will position you as an authority in your field, building trust and credibility among your audience. It encourages visitors to interact with your content, your website, or taking other desired actions, boosting overall engagement, engagement, and traffic. So pretty much bringing the traffic from the platforms that you're on to wherever you want them to go. It converts your brand's personality, values, mission, helping you establish a strong and consistent brand identity. And it helps you build a deeper connection with your audience, making them feel more aligned with your brand by sharing personal stories, values, and your mission. A person that lands on your page will decide in three seconds if they will engage with your page or not. This is very important why your bio needs to be clear and simple to understand. So here's a step-by-step -step guide to crafting a bio that resonates with your audience so you can attract those people to you, your brand, and whatever that you do, okay? So number one, incorporate searchable keywords in your name. This is very important because this is how people are going to uh, find you. So you can give them or help them out. So in the name field in your profile, you're going to include keywords related to your industry. This field is searchable uh, and it's going to help you improve your visibility. So for this example, if you're a digital marketing expert, you can use your name slash. And you don't have to use this slash, but it's good to, you know, it's just you use it as a separator. So example, name field with the keywords down here. So Sarah Lee slash fitness coach tom brown slash seo specialist so here's some examples right here this is uh one of my pages here peace because my name is morris peace so i just go by peace slash social media growth and content marketing now as far as this part right here when i'm on a certain platform i use terms that people are familiar with that way they can easily find me and what I help with, okay? Uh, one of my clients here, her name here, boom. And then highly searchable keywords, real estate investor, coach, motivational speaker, and whoever types this in on the search bar on any platform, you're most likely to pop up and be discovered. So again, when someone lands on your page, it should be clear. So when crafting your bio, just focus on these three elements to make it engaging and effective. You want to focus on who you help and with what, how you help your audience achieve desired result, call to action, and authority statement. If you don't have the authority statement, call to action, okay? So here are the examples for who you help and with what. It's important because you want to, people are going to follow you or engage with you if they understand what's in it for them. So guiding startups to secure their first 100 customers. Helping authors self-publish and market their books. Helping artists overcome creative blocks. So you're calling these people out and you're telling them, what do you help with? What do you help with? Okay, this, this is the how. How you help them achieve the desired result okay which is pretty much your product or your service so step-by-step -step guides for launching online products cognitive behavioral therapy for anxiety management all right and then you have the call to action and your authority statement i would recommend if you have four sentences here like my client uh dr chuck you have the authority statement and a call to action so here are examples back Coming back over here, here are examples, excuse me. Over 20 years of industry experience, you're featured in whatever magazine or whatever accomplishment that you have, accomplishment that you have. Call to action is lose seven pounds in seven days. So you see the difference, right? With Dr. Chuck's before 
and after. He's a board certified surgeon. This is the authority statement. Helping you win by losing. Bariatrics, weight loss, and advanced liposcopy. And to request an appointment, you're going to click the link below. So in three seconds, here you know exactly who he helps and with what, how he helped them, authority, and the call to action. Compared to this, give us a call as we are helping you win by losing. It's still great, but take advantage of the real estate, if you will, for your bio and communicate this. And this is going to really help you attract the audience that you deserve. Now, let's say if you exactly don't know what to say or how to put it together, here's a chat GPT prompt and use this word by word, okay? Create an Instagram or create Instagram bio examples for a your type of profession, focusing on your specific niche or target audience. The bio should include who they help and with what, how they help them do that, an authority statement or the call to action. Now, the only thing that's missing here is like with Dr. Chuck, just include some emojis on the left side. So these are just examples of bullet points that just helps it um, make it more clear and it can add a little bit more, uh, you know, style to your bio. But so I like to do these uh, with my bios as well. Now, if you need more professional help, um, such as helping you with filming, editing videos, scripting, ideas, posting, getting leads, nurturing those leads, and turning those into phone calls with only two to four hours a month of your time so you can focus on working on your business and not in it, click a link somewhere around this video and I'd love to hop on a call with you and get to know more about your situation and how I can help you do that. All right, thank you guys so much for attending this free training and peace. I love to know your feedback, by the way. So then peace. <laughs> All right, guys, take care.